halogase, fast is more recurred in our life, so our PC also needs speed for help us in working. So today we taking one special topic depend PC's speed. We started from HDD then SSD and NVMe. Now we looking for make more fast our NVMe's. Corsair teases first PCIe 5.0 SSD with 10,000 megabytes per second of bandwidth. Corsair is teasing performance metrics of its first PCIe 5.0 SSD, the Corsair MP700. The Corsair MP700 Gen 5 PCIe X4 NVMe 2.0 M.2 SSD features impressive 10,000 megabytes per second sequential read speeds and 9,500 megabytes per second sequential write speeds. The company touts the drive is ready for a M5, but that doesn't stop until Alder Lake and upcoming Raptor Lake users from benefiting as well. The MP700 is 40% faster than Corsair's fastest PCIe Gen 4 drive, the MP600 Pro XT, in both sequential read and write speeds. This can be attributed to PCIe 5.0's higher bandwidth. In the M.2 form factor, PCIe 5.0 allows for a maximum of 15.8 gigabytes per second. The MP700 basically confirms we're likely to see PCIe 5.0 drives in consumers' hands this year, from not only Corsair, but other drive manufacturers as well. While Intel was ready for PCIe 5.0 last year with Alder Lake, manufacturers simply weren't ready to launch PCIe 5.0 drives when Alder Lake was released. PCIe 5.0 SSDs were originally expected to hit only the enterprise market in 2022, but, thanks to Silicon Motion's new enthusiast grade SM2508 controller, PCIe 5.0 SSDs looked ready to make a limited appearance in the consumer enthusiast space. With the upcoming launch of M5, as well as Intel's new Raptor Lake CPUs and 700 series chipset motherboards, it will be exciting to see. PCIe 5.0 drives in the wild now that the technology is going mainstream. At the moment this is just a teaser from Corsair, there's no release date or full spec shared on the site. But with the drives advertised association with AMD's upcoming AM5 platform, we suspect it will launch around the same time as AM5, in September or by the end of the year. There is another faster storage connectivity, Fison demos M.2 PCIe 5.0 X4 SSD, up to 12 Gbps reads. Fison this week showcased its next-generation PS5026 E26 SSD platform with a PCIe 5.0 X4 interface aimed at high-performance desktops and enterprise applications. Based on the demonstration, the new drives will radically improve the sequential read and write performance. Because of the PCIe 5.0 X4 interface that offers raw bandwidth of up to 15.8 gigabytes per second in each direction, solid-state drives featuring this interface are projected to increase sequential read and write speeds of SSDs drastically. Other improvements include higher capacities thanks to new 3 dna ND devices, enhanced reliability, and new features enabled by next-generation controllers. Fison's reference SSD featuring its PS5026 E26 controller and 1TB of Micron's 3D TLC memory provides a maximum sequential read speed of up to 12,457 MB per second and a maximum sequential write speed of up to 10,023 MB per second according to Crystal Disk Mark, which by far exceeds capabilities of today's best SSDs. As for random performance, the drive can provide up to 1.31 million 4 Kelvin read IOPS, and up to 1.16 million 4 Kelvin read IOPS, which is higher than the vast majority of client PCIe 4.0 X4 drives. Fison's first-generation PCIe Gen 5 E26 SSD controller is powered by ARM's Cortex R5 cores accompanied by special-purpose accelerators from the company's COX processor 2.0 family. The controller can work with all contemporary and future types of 3 dna ND memory featuring ONFI 5. X and Toggle 5, X interfaces at up to 24 OMT, S data transfer speeds. Since Fison positions its PS5026 E26 both for client and enterprise usage, the controller also supports functionality like PCIe dual port connectivity for U3 SSDs, single root input, output virtualization SRIOV, and zone namespaces ZNS. Fison did not reveal when the first client SSDs based on the PS5026 E26 controllers will be available commercially. However, last year it implied that the first drives using its PCIe 5.0 X4 platform would hit the market in the second half of 2022. These SSDs should come to market in the same time frame as the Zen 4-powered AMD Ryzen 7000 processors. Kyoxia unveils PCIe Gen 5.0 SSD 
prototype performance, up to 14,000 megabytes per second read speeds and almost double the I.O. performance over Gen 4.0 SSDs. Keoxia's PCIe Gen 5.0 prototype SSDs already offer twice the bandwidth of Gen 4.0 SSDs with higher I.O. performance and lower latencies. Being the world's second largest manufacturer of flash memory products, Keoxia has stated during an event that it will be launching its first PCI Gen 5.0 SSDs as early as Q4 2021. The SSDs will be known as the CD7 series and will come in 2.5 EDSF FE3S form factor initially with a Gen 5.0 X4 connection before moving to a standardized NVMe platform. The drives will also be aimed at the Data Center 8 channel controller and Enterprise 16 channel controller segments first before arriving in consumer segments. The PCIe Gen 5.0 SSD prototype features a sequential read speed of up to 14,000 megabytes per second and a write speed of up to 7,000 megabytes per second. That's a 103% and a 67% jump in sequential speeds over Coxia's Gen 4 SSD solution, respectively. Moving over to I.O. performance, you will be getting up to almost twice the random read and random write performance, respectively while IOPs are increased by 50%. Lastly, we have the latency figures which show up to 77% reduction in read and 50% reduction in write latencies. So all in all, we have some pretty big numbers coming in for next-gen PCIe 5 SSDs. As for when the next-gen PCIe 5.0 SSDs pop up in the consumer segment, well they are expected sometime in 2022 as more platforms from AMD and Intel start to hit store shelves. The Intel Alder Lake CPUs will support PCIe Gen 5.0 links for SSDs too but it looks like the industry is waiting for Fison to finalize their Gen 5.0 SSD controller for mass production. Fison will definitely be the choice for premium Gen 5.0 SSDs while competing with Samsung's own controllers. Marvel has also announced its Bravera SC5 SSD controller based on PCIe Gen 5.0 0 that hits the market in 2022 along with Silicon Motion's own solution. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.